Now what can happen is if you install the optical drive and the connector is just a bit off it can be bent and as a result of that it's not going to make contact with the optical drive and it will therefore not function. Now you have to be very careful with this because if this is damaged it's going to require it's going to have to be professionally reconnected onto the motherboard. Now if it's bent you can bend it back with a needle nose plier now to access it you're gonna have to you're gonna have to take apart the laptop okay now right here is the connector for the optical drive if the optical drive is put through here is installed and it just goes straight and it doesn't interlock properly it could strike the connector and cause it to bend so what you need to do is you need to take a needle nose plier and very gently adjust the connector to make sure it interlocks properly and this all has to be done gently and with precision because if you push it in too hard you can damage the connector so until you get it right keep on moving the connector very gently until it properly interlocks with the optical drive and this may fix a non-functioning optical drive so I hope you found this video useful. If you have, please show your support for this channel by subscribing. Feel free to leave comments. Please like up this video. And thank you for tuning in.